Bottom line 72. What's up, multiverse? This is going to be the unboxing slash kit review slash uh, first progression on my tribute bid uh, bill to my father. He just passed away this year. So he had a 72 C10. He had many rides in his life, but. I'm going to try to do this build in um, Model Mine 72 full burn. Take my time on it, of course. This is the Crew Chief. AMT Crew Chief. Retro Deluxe Enhanced Reissue featuring original parts. Restored. Expanded decal sheet. Vintage package art. New match and paint guide. Chevy Blazer outfitted. As an engineer wagon. This kit is a classic kit. For all practical purposes. And uh, I just think it's going to make a fine tribute build. So. I'm going to open it up. And get into it. And let you see. What we're working with. So that you can build it stock or off road. It's got all the four-wheel drive parts and stuff in there. A lot of those parts are probably going to be used in other builds. Because um, I think I'm going to um, be doing some... Uh, a lot of scratch building, custom modifications, stuff like that. On this one, you know, my father taught me practically everything I know about automobiles. Uh, he was a car guy, and uh, he got me into cars at a really young age. Cars, trucks, you know, anything with wheels, basically. Taught me all about tools. You know, used to take me to work with him when I was a little kid. Um, he worked many different places, but one place, uh, I, I, I'm just going to tell some stories, you know, throughout this build. About the man that it's, you know, tributed after. Um Oh, the smell of fresh styrene in the morning. Look at all that good fresh styrene goodness right there. Anyway, he used to work at this one uh, place. It was like a, a classic um, muscle car type restoration place where they would uh, fix cars to go to shows, like show cars. I remember one day they had this 56 uh, Chevy. Man, this thing looked like I mean, it was a show car, 100% trailer queen. I actually think the the show that they took it to at that particular time, it took it took some awards home. I just remember all these good stories about going to work and working on these these cars that were just like, I mean, they were just amazing cars, you know. Anyway, let's get into this. We got this uh, '72 Crew Chief body right here okay this is what we're looking at right here love the, we uh, you know i love this um this uh, model this body style of the chevy even you know in the truck form blazer form just um the body style the panel lines the flow of the design i just i've, I've always loved this this design so got a we got the um, body. Next we're gonna check out the chrome. 
There's a big bag of chrome, a lot of goodies right there. Looks like we got uh, two different hubcap dealies. So, a lot of these parts are probably going to find their way onto other builds because you know you can never have too many parts. Model Mine 72 recommends you to have the biggest parts lot that you can acquire because those parts always seem to find their, themselves onto a build, another build somewhere. This is our glass. Where they got it packaged. It looks like they've got the tail light thing in its own uh, little area, then separated by the windshield, headlights, and then the back and side panel. So, taking really good care to not scratch up the, the glass and the, and the kit. All right, here's a bag of fresh styrene goodness right here. Looks like the interior with the seats, some interior panels, dash, whatnot. This is a really good pop, guys. I'm not seeing much flash at all. So the repop of this, um, they did really, did really well on this kit that I'm finding. Yeah. So this is another big bag of styrene goodness. Looks like this is a lot of the four-wheel drive parts, suspension parts, frame, the back of the blazer shell. Look, this kit, this kit's going to be absolutely uh, astonishing, amazing for me to build. I mean, you know, I'm just going to have a lot of fun with it. Look at this big gigantic bag of tires. I mean, this thing's got some wheelage. Definitely got some wheels that come in it. I was wondering about these um, these 4x4 ones. Because uh, I might put them on another, another build. Because this one right here. So you kind of got street tires. And then you kind of got your 4x4 tires. Comes with two metal axles, which will, will be good if you're drag racing. I'm not. I don't think I'm going to turn this one into a drag racing model. I think it's going to be a stationary piece. But um, you know, I can use those parts for other ones. Here's our instructions. The uh, crew chief, Chevy Blazer. So. Pretty much standard AMT issued. Got your paint guide there. Different uh, interior frame things. Final assembly. Looks like you got around eight steps to get to the final assembly. But um, it's a wonderful, wonderful kit so far, guys. I'm just a wonderful. Just amazed by the whole thing. AMT got some promotional stuff in here. This is probably some of the kits and stuff that they got going on today. This is us right here. Da -da -dun -da -dun -dun. That's one we building the crew chief. Um, they re you know round two is reissuing a lot of these old kits. Crew chief Chevy Blazer matching paint guide. This right here is it comes with like a paint guide if you wanted to follow it and kind of do that deal. You can. Let's check out this uh, wonderful de decal sheet. Oh my God! Look at that! Isn't that beautiful? I mean, if you were gonna go with certain, um, if you were gonna go with these decals, it wouldn't be a, it wouldn't be bad, you know. I mean, they're they're amazing. Amazing decal sheet. Lots and lots of uh, beautiful decals on here. So, I'm not sure on the paint on this one right now, but, you know, in further updates, I'm sure we'll get 
we'll get to that. Round two models.com is a little business reply card. And I think this one has, yeah, it does. It has one of these little AMT model box kits that come with it. You can kind of pop this out, put it together, and it's like a little miniature model box. Which um, I think these are, <laughs> they're just a little, you know, little uh, add extra, little extra thing if you um, want to have that in your shop hanging up somewhere or displayed. So there we go with our kit review of our uh, 72 Crew Chief AMT reissue from Round 2 Models. This is going to be a tribute build to my father, and I'm going to uh, take my time with this build. It's not going to be uh, no rush. There's no time limits on my builds anyway. Anybody that follows this channel knows that I don't do time limits. Um, you know, <clears throat> I think a model, every model is a lesson, and I think that every model has its own time. And uh, it's 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 up for debate if a model is ever finished or not, you know, because there again, you can do everything you want and then come back and add stuff later. So you can take it apart, repaint it, you know, go, go you know, go from 4X4 to two wheel drive, go to two wheel drive to 4X4, you know, I mean, change up everything, basically. So this right here is the kit review of the crew chief and uh, we're going to enjoy building this kit so thank you guys for tuning in and giving me your ear I hope you follow along on this build it's it's a very meaningful build and um, can't wait to get started on it model mine 72 over now.